was thinking about that too. Running off on that good vibe, boy. Got our fries. What did you get? This I got boneless. Is boneless. This is mine. I got honey barbecue. God damn. Mm -hmm. You got that big box. Good bro, this is my friend good. in the background. Say hi. Hi. That's the bestie. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I had to get me carrots. That shit's too real. <clears throat> We ain't no goddamn carrots. My eyesight like is good. You could have had a little sugar mama moment before we broke up. I bet. See? See? There was a point in time when we broke up. I don't know where this conversation popped up right before we started uh, recording. You know, when me and him broke up, we broke off for a little bit. And I had like a little sugar daddy moment, but without the sugar. <laughs> you know, I had to get my nails done. I was getting all that pampered. What was your sugar mama moment? New sticks, guns, <laughs> game systems, cars. I know that white girl wasn't no damn sugar mama. It was gross. <laughs> <laughs> which one? Uh, which one? That's what I'm saying. Which one? <laughs> I thought there was only one. So which one? <laughs> He's shaking his head. Yes, there was only one, but which one? <laughs> but I bet it was more than one girl. I had one. One sugar father and one omelette. Oh, I'm talking about just that time we broke up? Yeah. Yeah, we're going one. That bitch was broke. Mm. Not when we first met. First met, she was cool. Working. I probably said that bitch right, that's why. She's buying all my tree tree. Cause you was taking her to work. Mm -hmm. Second the text came in, I'm, huh? He got her eyes. Give me that. Mm -mm. I can hurt her eyes. I hurt that. Fuck. No, I got paid today. <laughs> mm -hmm. Didn't even know. I was counting on the second I paid her. She like, yeah, he hit my car. Yeah, we're gonna write to the ATMs. No, it's a big dog. I was, um, he was like trying to, um, bring out his, uh, his clothing brand or whatever. And I would literally like take pictures of this man's shirts. Are you serious? Like the clothes, like his, his name brand. Looking like a straight cornball. An old geezer. <laughs> a straight geezer. And when we got back together though, he came and clutched maybe once or twice. Yeah, I didn't care about what? All her little friends came in clutch. That's why I was down on my dick. Mm -hmm. Who is broke? Not broke anymore. Mm -hmm. Definitely not anymore. I ain't even, I used to be broke. Like, and he would give me like $100, $200 for five photos. That's it. Yeah. Just like pull up, take a few, couple pictures, and then I would leave. This dude paid me for my eight pics. Hey. Sold them for me for like three hundred. I thought a about that. Three hundred for a pic. I go get my feet done and sell my feet finder. Oh my I, mama! I sure did too. I help you out there. This one dude freaking paid me to get my freaking toes done and my nails and to get a facial when I was at Dakota. Oh. Dakota knew about it. 
I said, I wouldn't, what? I was <laughs> you, like, you gonna talk about you gonna make my bitch look good. Go ahead, G. I ain't gonna knock you. Go ahead. Give right Cause she gonna be over here talking something mean. <laughs> I took Dakota out with that money, too. Mm-hmm. The money Buddy was giving me, I had bought him cigarettes. That was when we first got into this, like, we were living across the bridge in Missouri. And we stayed in this, like, rinky-dinky apartment place where you paid, like, monthly. Mm -hmm. It was a hotel. Hotel, but everybody and their mama look like they've been there for years. Mm-hmm. And the hotel it started running out. This whole, uh, that one by the old movie theater, what it used to be like before they tore it down. Well, uh, Commander's Inn. That's how it used to look like. That's where my mama used to stay with us. <laughs> mm-hmm. Commander's Inn. It wasn't a bad hotel, to be honest. No, oh, so. Is that that one that was on Metropolitan? I only been there once, picking up this stripper bitch. She straight sold herself there. Sold it for ten dollars and fifty cents. The one that was, it's like, uh, uh, it was like right across the movie theater though in Leavenworth. The one they tore it down and then they built that one fancy ass looking one. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. It was huge. Like they had an upstairs and shit. I know we tried to have like a hotel party. Oh, Over there, and they kicked all of us out. The police came. We started running. I told you I get permission from them first. They gonna catch my ass. I'm back. I think I was on the run then. I couldn't. Yeah, they for sure gonna catch my ass. The hotel owner said leave. You said leave. Okay. Okay. I'm leaving. <laughs> oh yeah. After I ran from all the way in the G to Sonic, that was the last time I would ever run. I was so fucking tired. But you know when you're running from the police, that adrenaline rush you get? I thought I was the Flash. <laughs> I ran from the police in Lansing. I took a four and I couldn't find my ass. I thought I was going to get caught. That's really how they didn't find me in the G. They thought I ran into, um, this is when Keyshawn and Imani still had that apartment uh, right there. They thought I ran into one of those apartments. Nope. I had Go jumped us. that fence and I ran through woods. You snitching ass baby mama. Mm -hmm. Snitching. She did snitch. You the one who told me. You no, know, my big mom was like, I got she ran in the woods. I got, beat, I got mm. him beat up that day. Yeah. Because, like, Listen, when agent. I ran from the police, that was when uh, he had went back to his baby mama. So, you know, respectfully, you know, we wasn't connected like we are now. We ain't locked in like we was, like we is now. Yeah, you ever try to leave Sam, there's going to so, be a couple. But in the beginning of our relationship, he went back to his baby mama and his family. Okay, me being a respectful ass person, I'm not no homewrecker. If you want to try to get your family back together, do that. I have respect for that, you know. I'm running from the police. And literally, there's a trash can. And he's on this side of the trash can. So, I didn't see it until I come running. And then I stopped, and we just sitting there. No, oh, you hit back. Yeah, you hit back from the background. Sam, run! run. <laughs> and I was like, oh, yeah, I forgot. I'm getting chased by the police. <laughs> <laughs> and so I kept running. And that's when I ran through the woods and stuff. And then, you know, when we got back together, he told me he got beat up by his baby mama because we were sitting there staring at each other. <laughs> hmm? She be trying to beat up everybody. Everybody and the mama. Huh? <laughs> Clarence, whooped, mm -hmm. Clarence whooped her ass. She hit my stuff at you, but Clarence's motto is if you hit me first, I'm going to hit you back. Mm -hmm. That's it. Hell yeah. You have respect for me, I have respect for you. And the cops just looked at him when they showed up because she called the police on him. That's her uncle, though. I mean, I tried that shit on my mom. Called the police. They pulled up. He was like, is this your mom? I'm like, yeah. What she would be for? Oh, because I was skipping school. 
Uh, you do it again, we're gonna come back and whoop you too. What? <laughs> Nigga, get the fuck out of here. Did they really tell you that? Mm-hmm. They gonna whoop your ass too. Mm. Mr. Sweets. Ah! Um, I believe it. Yeah, I believe it. <laughs> he showed was like, do it again. And he started trying to take off his belt. Yeah, all right. Okay, that's a little too far, buddy. You ain't about to whoop me with no motherfucking belt. <sighs> He's literally the only one that could probably get me out of a house. Yeah, that's the one. Man, we hey, used to sweet. tussle with that you nigga this month. Mm -hmm. That shit was good. Shit was frank. Yeah. He straight dark that shit. All you see is a bunch of bones, and then the bottom. I'm a slow eater. My pregnant ass cannot. I don't play with that shit. Cannot gobble shit down. No I more. eat that shit like it's running away, G. <laughs> No, because you really hurt my feelings. She said it was sweet. It's not sweet. Hell no, nah, that shit is sweet. <laughs> Man, what time is it? Where's my phone? Where you got your it's finger out of It's almost camera. four. It's like three minutes to four. You gotta go to work. Uh, uh. <laughs> you just use a fucking. Yep, I fried to pick my tooth. French fries, a toothpick. Mm. Really? Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna stop it. It's gonna fall. How? We done drove like that a million times. It's gonna fall. Right. We'll to get you see him rushing me? Big rush. Time is money. And money is time. <laughs> Fuck. I got money in my phone case. Too. Yeah. Mm. They trying to rush this pregnant baby mama to eat. I ain't gonna care. You gotta go to work, y'all. Fatherly duties. As a father, what are like the three hardest things about being a father? A father. Patience. Gotta have patience. Whenever I first, when I very first have kids, my patience was uh uh. That shitty diabetes. I fucking hate a shitty Nike. And the third one was the third one. I ain't gonna lie, that's only that's it. You only have two. Shitty diapers and patience. Cause the rest is beautiful to me. See something created from nothing to something. It's beautiful. And my daughter got a my my kids. Let me, yeah, let me state that my kids have a personality of their own. I think that's my favorite thing is watching their personality grow, like their character. Mm hmm. Mama is my literally favorite. She's so damn bad. Oh yeah, she mean as fuck. Uh -uh. She's so sweet. Mm -hmm. She mean. No, but every time she sees them, she hugs. Mm hmm. Give me hugs. The second y'all leave, she over there. I was sitting there watching my uh my little TV show yesterday. I'm sitting there laying down. She come and jump on my face. Ah! What are you screaming in my damn cheek for? <laughs> she'll um she'll yell inside my belly like she'll She's put her mouth on my belly and ah! and then beat the belly up. Wait, have you so uh, have you scheduled a C-section yet? No, that's why I was trying to see about the insurance. Yeah, what hospital Blue Cross Blue Shield goes through. I hate the insurance part of life. Like, mm. it's doing a lot. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. 
right, why can't I just go in the hospital and y'all help me? Because I need help. It wouldn't be like that. We probably, we probably wouldn't have as many diseases and shit. God might bless us. Hospitals always want, 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 want. You see, they didn't stop. They didn't stop texting me about one of my uh, physician bills. They'll text me every week. You owe, you owe, you owe. Too bad. That's all on them. Too damn bad. Look at your neck. I'm trying to see what uh, parts I need for my 300. Are you thinking? Because I know I need a torque wrench. I ain't going to go back to the old school. I'm going to spend a little extra $100. That's the channel he's working on for y'all. He's, he's really trying to build up his channel for, like, the men. But his car channel. My big 300, you hear me? Mm-hmm. Big three. He got a real pretty Chrysler. He's gonna pop out with a couple times. Do a bunch of <laughs> dangerous. Just dangerous. There's so many times I've almost died in the car with this man. It's not even funny. But did we? No. It don't count. But we almost did. It don't count. Your boy's a what? A driver, but still. Ah, right, whip the shit out there. When I tell foot. you. You seen a, a big ass truck on the left, and then just us crash into a pole on the right. And then he said, us Sir! in the middle. I was like, Get "Oh my god!" Got the fuck about it there. I was sitting there like, "Oh my god!" It was death on the left and just injury on the right. I was that? I don't know how, but he drifted. He drifted up out the way of the truck, and it was like a. One of them big ass construction trucks, you know, where they trash trucks. No, it wasn't a trash truck. It was one of them big white trucks that you can carry shit in. Like if if they was mm -hmm. like taking all the dirt and they would put it in. Like it, boy, it was, it was something else. And I never see like if you if you from Kansas City, you know how some of the houses towards like Jay's Fish and Chicken are like this far apart from each other Hello? they're like this far apart from each other Hello? this man done drifted in into the neighbor's yard up the dirt hill and parked on the side of the house what are you doing shorty and parked on the side of the house how you drift in this much area and then park your tahoe it was a tahoe at that big body square body Ain't no motherfucking way. I thought we was gonna go right through his mama, mama bedroom, cause it was literally the driveway, the driveway in the house, and then the neighbor's hill. He skirt, and you felt control. the whole truck just boom, park. All under control. Dangerous, <laughs> dangerous. I guess I'm done eating. Since you wanna rush me. I didn't rush. I just wanna watch one of my TV shows. I don't know, that sound like being kind of good right now. Oh, but we made it. Shit. So, so you know, I guess we'll catch she a boy. We about it in, ho. I guess I'm Tapping cool. with y'all another time, shorty. All right. Oh, yeah. Had, like, we comment, had? subscribe. Right. Follow the channel. Mm hmm You know, uh, our daily Liz Ice. Turn on your notification bell. So... Tap in, little uglies. Peace out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See her in the background just look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one of these. It was like one of them big old trucks. And when I tell you, he almost drifted into this truck. But we did it though. Like somehow, some way, God let him drift around the truck. Oh, and I was. They 
You need like an intro song. Yeah. Be like, uh, who do you be watching? The Phase Group? Nah. Up in this chapel where you get low. No. That's like a 6K. Look at what That's a 6K. Go tap in with him. Oh, Legends? Yeah. I yeah. am Legends. Nah, that nigga boy. Tristan's going with him in freaking Texas. 62 degrees outside. In Texas. Mm -hmm. She was like, yeah, We're going out there in March. Mm -hmm. See, I just can't go to another town with only dollars and pennies. Uh -uh. I'm going on a vacation this year. We're going to go on some type of vacation. Some type of vacation. Yo, we're going to drop the kids off at grandma's. So I'm going to only drop one of the Teslas already. Mm -hmm. Just like be on the highway like this. Eating a fat ass cheeseburger. <laughs> Alright, but if you came and finally got to the end of the video, thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for supporting. We'll catch y'all on another video, another mukbang. We try to put out more content out there, but we do work. We do have kids, so we have a life. But <laughs> tap in. <laughs>